In this video, we are going to help this level 1 noob reach second C using the love group. Are you ready guys? Let's go! Where the actor slam oh, there it is. forward! There's your slam! There's the dump! Hello, Gamer Nom is back. So guys, please join me on leveling up this noob and reaching second C. And we are gonna start by eating this fruit. This terrible tasting fruit. As you can see, we've already unlocked one skill, the pistol, but we're not yet gonna use that. We're gonna do our usual first quest, the I am snake quest. So we're gonna need to find chickens, okay? So guys, this is a problem. How do we jump? More challenges, but don't worry guys, I got you. So for our first chicken, you can get it by jumping here. You can click it from here, but you can still jump on the terrace. I'm gonna show it to you later. That's the first chicken. Next up, the spawn point. There are some structural changes, like for example, the black market. But still, that is where the chicken is located. See this? Oh, wait. Okay, so here's the entrance. <laughs> Sorry about that. There you go. There's a the chicken. Okay. So guys, you need to do this until you reach level 11. Okay? Level 11. That's enough. Again, if you're having problems, on going to a specific area that is high, there's always a foothold that you can look for, okay? Again, level oh no, we're level 12 here. Again, stats put all on the power fruit. I'm gonna show you how strong. The first skill, the pistol. Guys, it can hit multiple enemies as long as it is within the range. There you go. See that, guys? The cooldown is very fast, which means fast leveling up, okay? At level 13, you can unlock your second skill. Which is so cool, right? It's very fast. The lovely. Again, at 50 power foot. X skill, the lovely. I'm gonna show it to you. There you go. See that? It's a shorter range comparing it to the pistol, but the damage is higher. And it can also hit multiple enemies. So again, in the first stages of this leveling up phase, there are no problems. At level 20, you can start defeating Smokey. I think 3 skills is needed to defeat him. Two combos, two sets of skills, so you need to dodge the first one, and there you go. Very easy, guys. Very easy. Good start and adding more luck. There are some other players who grind, and we can help each other, right? So there. Again, level up a bit faster. We're gonna do this until you reach level 30, guys. But, but, we can already unlock the third skill here. See that? At level 26, 100 power foot, we can unlock out the Servant Arrow. Guys, why 26? I allotted 4 stat points on the defense. So there you go. One hit now. Very easy. See that? One combo. Even without our friend. <clears throat> so next up, we're gonna defeat Tashi. Again, C skill, dodge. Tashi might use C skill. Long range skill. There you go. Guys, you're gonna do this until you reach level 50. Everything will be easy, I'm telling you. Okay, so at 150, here are the stats. 184, I think we're gonna go 200 now and unlock our last skill, which is the Hurricane Kick. And we're gonna use this skill in the next island. This will be very helpful. There you go, we're gonna just defeat Tashi once more and leave and proceed to the next island. Whoop. By the way, Galleon was updated. Looks cooler now. Next up, Pirate Island, guys. We're gonna start by defeating the Clown Pirates, how do you defeat them? Very easy, use your V skill, there you go, it's enough to burst these 3 mobs, you need to defeat 5, wait for them to spawn, and you just need to use your C skill and start running, or maybe your X skill, the lovely, and pistol, there you go. You guys, it's very easy, do this until you reach level 75, 75, why? Because that is the time to move on to your next mob, which is the Clown, okay? Let's look for that Clown, Buggy Clown. There you go, the clown. Again, one combo. Use your C skill, your lovely, and your pistol. There you go. Oh, only C skill and pistol is enough. Sorry. So guys, we're gonna do this until you reach level 100. And proceed to the next island, which is the soldier island. And in this island, you can buy your Soru. Again, leveling up here is very easy, I'm telling you. The Soru costs 50k, so we're gonna start by defeating the commanders. Again, Pistol and Lovely. Okay. Use your Soru, use your Servant Arrows. And you can use here your Hurricane Kick or Pistol and Lovely. And that's enough guys. One quest done, one level up. I suggest that you master using your skills so that level up will be faster. But when you reach level 120, you can now proceed to your next mob or your next target, the Captain. 
guys you can finish the captain and move to the commanders captain commanders captain commanders okay or you just defeat this it really depends to you so you're gonna do this until you reach level 145 and after that you can proceed to your next enemy the axe hand so guys is there a faster way yes burst this axe hand and then go back to the captain and go back to the axe hand don't worry i'm gonna show it to you okay okay let's go so guys get first get the quest okay here you go c skill z skill and that's enough you do, dash dash get the quest okay how do you know if you did it correctly guys the moment that you jump here the axe hand shouldn't have spawned yet okay so now he spawned so meaning you didn't waste a single second okay you're gonna do this until you reach level 200 why 200 guys we're gonna skip one quest in the next island the shark island don't worry i'm gonna show it to you now there you go okay here shark island we're gonna skip the first quest and proceed to defeating the karate fishman again guys c skill z or v i don't know just use your skills and you will defeat it very fast the goal here is to reach level 230 once you reach that level everything will be a lot faster i'm telling you guys so fast okay now stat check 100 defense uh let's put some on the melee right now so yeah 20 melee 100 defense 800 powerful so here we are on the next quest the shark man guys this is my favorite area why check this out c skill right and z skill the quest is done accept the moment that your c skill has cooled down there you go you can use it again the mob has spawned. The spawn time of Sharkman is so short, which made it very good for this fruit. The goal here is to level up until you reach level 350. Again, we're gonna skip some quests in the chef ship. So we're heading towards that ship. There you go. In this ship, we skip two, two quests, the black leg and the other one. We're gonna focus on defeating the weapon man. Always start with your C skill. Then you can follow it up with the pistol or the lovely. You're gonna do this until you reach level 400. And after that, we are going to move on to our next island, which is the snow island. Guys, is it fast? For me, this fruit is one of the best fruits to use in grinding in the first sea. Don't worry, we're gonna try and cover the sand fruit too. So here we are, guys. We're gonna do this quest. Use your V skill. There you go. There you can kick and servant's arrow and you can use your pistol and lovely on the last mob. And that's it. We're done with this quest. Target level is 450. Yes. When we reach level 450, we will start defeating the king of snow. There you go. King snow, sorry. So again, same combo. C skill, Z skill, and V skill. And that's enough. Defeat this until you reach level 500 to make it faster because we can start defeating the heavy man. Where is that heavy man? Here we go. So guys, just a tip. Defeat the heavy man. Dash is your sorrow. Go fast to the king of snow. King snow, sorry. Defeat this and then go back to heavy man. But if you want, you can just stay here and wait for it to spawn. But guys, you're gonna do this until you reach level 625. That's like oh, 100 plus levels. So now, after that, proceed to the Sky Island. But wait, gamer now. The level here is so high, the requirement. Don't worry, guys. We're just here to get the observation hockey. So it costs... Let's check. Yeah, 1.5 million. Get that and proceed to the Desert Island. So here, we're gonna level up in the Bomb Man. Bomb Man. We skip the Candleman quest. Oh, there you go. You're gonna do this, guys, until you reach level 725. Same same technique, guys. C skill, Z skill, and lovely. Okay? Pistol, lovely, and uh, what do you call it? Servant arrow. So now, at 725, we can start defeating the King of Sand. So, guys, if you wanna defeat this, you're gonna use your observation hockey. Our damage is not the problem, it's just the range. Okay? So, after defeating him, you can proceed to the Bomb Man. There you go. Defeat this easily and go back. To the king of sand so we're gonna do this until you reach level 800 okay at 800 we're gonna proceed and go back to the sky island and remember where you got your observation hockey oh 
There you go. We're gonna start here with the Sky Soldiers. Again, guys, you only need to defeat four. So use your Hurricane Kick. Guys, the range of this is not enough to burst all four. So you need to use two skills. Hurricane Kick and Servant Arrow. So you're gonna do this until you reach level 850. And after that, go to the upper yard and start defeating the Ball Man. Guys, do you remember the Shark Man? This is the same as the Shark Man. You're gonna level up here so fast. You're here, the Quest Giver. The moment that your skill cooldown, the Ball Man will spawn. So here you go. What level gamer now? We're gonna stay here until you reach level 1050. Yes, 1050. Gamer Nom, there's the Ramble Man here at 900. Guys, it's kinda hard because you will really get hit by the Ramble Man. But if you want to get the pole, then level up here and make it harder for you. <laughs> well, anyway, just showing you now, we're gonna proceed to the next island. By the way, this is the second to the last island where we will level up. So now, we are here in the Bubble Island. We're gonna start by defeating the soldiers, but here we go. I'm gonna buy this, the Buso Haki. There are lots of comments, why are you not buying it, etc. Guys, this is just a uh, account wherein I level it up to 700, and after that, let's see if it gets awakened. So I don't really care much on the Hockeys here. We're just here to level up. So guys, did you see that? We defeated the soldiers really fast. Use your V skill, C skill, and wait for it one to spawn. So we're gonna do this until you reach level 1100. After that, proceed to the captain. Oh sorry, the leader. Yeah, the leader. So guys, use your C skill dodge because he's gonna hit you with a long range technique. And after defeating him, go back to the soldiers. Defeat the soldiers. There you go, defeat five. And go back to this one, the leader. You're gonna do this until you reach level 1150. And after that, Pasta, Pacifista, or whatever they call it. You need Observation Hockey here, guys. But don't worry, he's just going to hit you once. So for every Observation Hockey, you can defeat it 8 times. Or even 9 times, okay? So again, guys, the spawn time of this mob is very fast. So you will really level up here really, really fast. Same with the Shark Man and the Ball Man, okay? So there you go. Gamer Gnome, until what level? Level 1350. Why? Because leveling up here is really, really fast. Comparing it in the last island. Yes, I forgot the name. Let's wait for it. <laughs> okay, so we're done here. 1,350. We're going to head there after we defeat this. By the way, you can level up here until 1,351. There you go. <clears throat> okay, now we're here. Okay. So for the stat check, max power, fruit... 300 the melee and every stat will be allotted in the defense. So here we are, giraffe guys, 1325 and the wolf. See that you can defeat two mobs now instead of just the wolf when you go here at level 1200, right? And the spawn time is kind of longer. Our target level here is 1450, and for the final 50 level ups, you will do it with the lion or Leo. Sorry. So here we go, Leo, the final mob. To level up with okay so now we've reached level 1500 and what's next game run up are we done no we need to go to the marine island the marine ford there you go and talk to the traveler so he is located here jump here jump here again jump here okay wait for the sky jump to cool down and jump here talk to him he will ask you to look for a map and that map is located in the fish land you need to defeat this season fishman for those asking gamer Nom, is it easy to get guys i defeated this like 50 times i guess 50 times yeah i'm not joking 50 times until i got the map after that go back to our island after this go back to the start island talk to the elite pirate and that's it for this video so what do you think guys is it worth it is it worth it to get the love fruit for me guys yes if you just want to level up fast use this fruit go to the second sea so guys, for my next video, Rumble Fruit Noob Level 1, I've been seeing lots of requests, so wait for that, okay? So again, to all the viewers, subscribers, supporters, I appreciate you all. This is GamerNom, and GamerNom out!